What is up YouTube? Clickwood here and I'm back bringing you guys another public service announcement type of video I guess you could call it because I want to tell you guys about an amazing deal that they are actually doing at Walmart right now for trade-ins. So if you're used to GameStop just screwing you on your trade-ins, this is the type of video for you because they're doing an amazing thing at Walmart. First of all, I want to tell you guys, if you guys don't, are, if you're not aware, Walmart actually does do trade-ins for video games. And the prices that they give are actually typically quite a bit better than what GameStop will actually give you. So that's a good thing. But actually right now they're doing a special deal with Call of Duty Advanced Warfare. And it's a good way for you to end up actually getting this game for free, as I'm going to call it. Because you do still have to trade in games. But obviously if you're not playing the games anymore, this is a good option for most people. But basically what they're doing is that if you trade in any games and you buy a copy of Call of Duty Advanced Warfare, you're getting an extra 50% on any trade in that you do. So like for example, Destiny right now, they're giving like 30 bucks or something along those lines. I want to say it's like 28 or 29 depending if you're on PlayStation or Xbox. That's that's like the standard price that they give. Then they give you an extra 50%. So 50% of that 30, roughly 30, is going to give give you somewhere between like 43 price for a game that's been out for a couple of months now in Destiny. So if you guys are interested in getting a copy of Call of Duty Advanced Warfare, trade in older games like that and you can actually get a really, really good price for it. But that's not it. If you're somebody that hasn't yet purchased an Xbox or, or a PlayStation 4, excuse me, this is only for PlayStation 4, I don't know why I said Xbox, but if you haven't yet purchased a PlayStation 4, they're actually doing a trade in deal where you get double the amount for your trade in. So, that's pretty damn impressive because, like I said, for a Destiny copy, for example, 28, 29 bucks, you double that and you're actually getting like 60 bucks almost for your trade-in. So that's pretty much full price for the game. And what they do is that if you buy a PlayStation 4, they're going to give you that double price. So um, what you end up doing then is that you're going to get a co you're going to get a copy of Call of Duty Advanced Warfare, a PlayStation 4, and then you're going to get double for all of your trade-ins. So that makes it pretty good. If you're somebody that's been waiting to get a ne next-gen console, this is really a great option for you because it's something that I would definitely be taking advantage of right now. If I didn't have a PlayStation 4, I would absolutely be doing this trade-in for all of my old games. And uh, you can also trade in other random electronics there as well. If you go to the Walmart website, and I'll leave a link to that in the description. Um, I'll also put an annotation up here above so that you can actually go ahead and click on that, and it'll take you right to the website. Uh, or I guess you can't click on it, but you'll have to like type in that URL because YouTube won't let me put an actual link to it. But uh, if you type in that URL, it'll bring you to the page where you can actually find out the price that they'll give you for your old games. And then you can go on there and add on an extra 50% or an extra, you can double it if you're getting a PlayStation 4. So just wanted to let you guys know about that because it really is a great deal. Hope you guys take advantage of it. If you have any questions or anything, I'd be glad to answer those. If you ask me what the price is that they're going to give you for a certain game or something, I'm probably going to tell you to screw off because you can go look at that yourself on the website. Please don't ask me to do your busy work, damn it. <laughs> just joking, guys. But seriously, though, uh, go on to their website and find out the prices that you can get because I think that you'll be pretty happy about it. It's a lot better than what you can get from GameStop. Definitely one of the better trade-in prices that you're going to find anywhere else. And actually, guys, the one thing that I found that was really interesting, and I don't really know how this is going to work because um, if I did my math correctly... I think you can get more than the price that it costs for Sunset Overdrive if you trade it in. Don't know what the specifics are on that, but I think that I saw something like Sunset Overdrive you could get like 35 or 40 bucks for or something like that. So if you double that and you get your, <laughs> like when you do your trade in for your PlayStation 4, if it's 35, that would give you $70. So I don't know. I mean, it's possible that you could just go buy copies of Sunset Overdrive, bring them to Walmart, and trade them in for $70. And net yourself 5 to $10, you know, including tax. That would be pretty interesting. I don't know how that's exactly going to work. Might want to call them and ask. But also keep in mind, guys, that not every Walmart does the trade-in thing. You need to make sure that yours does. I want you guys to call them and ask 
Don't ask me because I don't know the answer to that question. But there is actually a thing on that Walmart website that I'm going to leave a link to uh, where it'll tell you if they actually do trade-ins at that specific Walmart. Or it'll tell you, you know, where the closest one is at least to your, uh, to your location. So you can definitely do it that way. Or, of course, like I said, you can always call them and find out. And just make sure, though, when you guys bring those games in that you have the original case, you have a working copy of the game because they do check that. Uh, well, most of them do anyway. Sometimes the Walmart employees are incompetent and they won't check it. But uh, <laughs> definitely try and make sure, though, that you have that original game case because otherwise they won't accept it. So anyways, guys, that is going to do it for today's video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, be sure to hit that like button if you learned something. If I helped you out at all, I hope that I did. I'm not doing this to promote Walmart or anything like that because I kind of think they're a scummy company company overall but this just this specific thing I really think they do a great job on and I definitely I appreciate what they're doing for us gamers because it's just so hard to afford games now but they're they're doing this with a lot of the big games I know they did it for Madden and NBA but now they're doing it for games like Call of Duty as well so it's great to see them doing that I really do appreciate that on Walmart's behalf and uh, thank you guys so much again for watching the video Thank you, thank you. I really do appreciate it. Hope you learned something. Make sure you go out there and get that copy of Advanced Warfare. I want to see you guys on the PlayStation 4 or possibly on the Xbox One. I'm going to do a video on that as well here in the coming days, and you'll see why I'm talking about that. Thank you guys so much, and I will talk to you beautiful bitches again soon.